everyone, my name is Droogie Forever, and today, for the first time on the channel, we're going to play Darkwood. Um, I actually own a physical copy of this game on the Switch, but we're playing the PC version. But I actually supported the devs a lot because... So, this PC version that I'm playing right now, I got years ago for free on Pirate Bay. And it's one of the only things I've ever downloaded from Pirate Bay. And you might be wondering, why did I pirate this game? Well, the developers at the time put it on Pirate Bay for free, DRM free, and said, this is, you know, it's, it's a full version of the game. It comes with everything. We're releasing it for free so that people don't have to pirate it. If you don't have the money, you can download it. And then if you have the money later, buy it. And I thought that was such a cool thing to do. And I didn't have the money to buy it at the time. So I downloaded it. And then when they put the physical up on Super Rare Games, it's a European uh, physical game publisher. They did a physical copy for the Switch. I bought two copies, um, one to keep sealed and one to open. And um, I very much wanted to support them and then when limited run got the playstation 4 version i got that version as well and i have the vinyl album so i have paid it back in full multiple times now uh, so but i've never played the game on the channel so let's do that all right let's see here well no we'll do normal i think Uh, I don't want immersion breaking, so let's let's say no for that. But yeah, it's a really cool horror game. The devs are amazing people. Definitely support them if you can. Not as much as you don't have to do as much as I did, obviously. But I've I've tried to buy it all over the place ever since then because they were so cool. You know, nobody does that. Nobody. Respect the woods, be patient, focus. I'm focused. Yeah, I mean, how many developers would risk just putting their game out for free? No DRM, no nothing. Just, here you go. No, that was so cool of them. All these years later, I still think about that. I see hatred and fear in their eyes. As if I was responsible for the spreading disease. As if I were the source of all the misery plaguing this land. I have nowhere to hide from them, nowhere to run. The woods have closed us off from the outside world. We are all doomed. 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 All right, here we go. Search the table. Pills? Sure, give me those. My old notepad. Okay. What else we got? Oh, I thought it said medical notes. I thought I saw it. There it is. I know these notes by heart. I don't want to read them now. Well, I mean... We can push the chair... Okay, stop dragging it. All right, what do we got? Potatoes, the only edible thing growing on this land. I still have some left. A homemade device for producing moonshine. All right, let's see. No, I don't want to dismantle the window. Lamp. The generator is almost out of juice. I need to find a full gasoline can. My tools. The local patients can't be helped anyway. Yeah, but I mean, still... Let's see. 
You can only select and interact with objects within your reach. Just woken up. All right, here's a radio. The radio has been silent for years, although sometimes I think I can hear voices through the static. More medical notes. There's a wardrobe. Alcohol, rags, key. Open the front door of my house with this. Hey. Boards, matchstick. My medical book. Can we just, if I, no, okay. Okay. These are all potatoes, I think. Lock is jammed a long time ago. I used to keep useless junk in there anyway. All right. Okay. Let's see what's left here. We got a cage. They're empty. I spent too much time to lock him in there. Okay, so there's somebody in there. Here we got a photo. We got a medical bag. My old useless medical bag. And a camera. Okay. Oh, it does let me search that. Damn it. I forgot you got to get like super close to some things to search them. There's a rag. Okay. Yeah, I have the key. Left mouse. Oh, okay. Use key. There we go. Unlocked with key. Useless pile of trash now. People's Tribune. Okay. Wooden doll. Carved out face. My dog, I don't think he's gonna make it. I should end his suffering. I don't wanna do that. I really don't wanna do that. Okay, now, I'm gonna be out of space soon. Shouldn't have picked up so much stuff, I guess. Location found. Path. The woods have devoured all the roads that connect us to the outside world. No one is able to pass through this thicket. Fallen tree, location found. Okay, I doubt there's anything I can, yeah. What do we got here? Some boards. Oh man, I can only hold stacks of 10, I guess. Oh, can only hold stacks of five of those. I should craft a torch. Tab to access your inventory and crafting menu. Okay. Crafting. Torch. I cannot craft that one, but I can craft this one. 
What is that? Empty glass bottle. Oh, I didn't even realize that would empty a bottle. Well, shit. Hmm. Is there anything here? Looks weird. All right, abandoned house location found. Some rags. Hey! What the hell? doorway okay wait a minute was there a part of the house i wasn't able to get into close i don't need more rags so i'm not gonna pick those up wait a minute is this a deer what is this i didn't even notice this stuff in a few days it'll be completely absorbed I don't like the look of that tree. Or that one. Uh oh. There's a dude. Big metal key. Okay, but what can I drop? <laughs> the bone, maybe? 21. I don't have anywhere to put it. He's unconscious. I've never seen him around here before. He's only carrying a key and some journal. Since he managed to sneak in here, he must know how to get out. Of course he won't help me voluntarily. But that... is of no importance. I need to get out of this accursed forest. You hear me, rat? Show me how and I'll let you go. I sometimes hear her voice. She's calling me. Calling me to return home. Where is the exit? Where? Show me where. I'll kill you like a dog if I have to. That fucker stole my key. I could open it with a lockpick. I could use these rags to craft some bandages. Okay, I was going to say, that's not doing anything. Oh, there we go. 
flashlight, shovel. Okay. Too strong to dismantle. combination. Who's there? Please let me out. I don't know how. You gotta give me the combination, dude. Or this room. Okay, maybe it's this room. It's a knife laying there, but I can't pick it up. Table leg. Gasoline. I can feel the generator with that. Tank is empty. What do I do with this? Because it's not working anymore. Whoa. Two dials instead of eyes. Four eight nine two. I knew it had something to do with the radio. I couldn't remember. Can't. Oh, God. Shit. Shit, I missed. Plastic chick. I wish I could use this and that at the same time. Chapter one.
pleasant warmth is emanating from the oven. I can sense a strange yet familiar scent. It's the smell of the protective substance which gives me relative safety after dark. The vapors rising from the huge cauldron are distributed all over the house via long pipes. As long as I remain inside my hideout, I have a chance of surviving the night. Examine the oven. When I arrived here a couple days ago, the oven was basically prepared. I just needed to light it up to ensure my safety at night. This cottage must have been one of our hideouts. The inhabitants of these woods don't need to inhale this revolting gas. If I examine it again, will it do the same thing? Okay, look at the weird bottle. The label on the bottle says, Staying out of the reach of the protective substance after nightfall results in immediate death in 99 out of 100 cases. It is advised to evenly spread the gas inside the sleeping area. Warning, even a properly prepared substance does not guarantee 100% safety. Remain vigilant. It is recommended to stay in well-lit indoor areas in order to minimize the risk. Look inside the pot. A small, empty cast iron pot. I haven't used it yet. I haven't felt any hunger or thirst since the accident a few days ago. I can't stop thinking about one thing. These mushrooms, these red, pulsating mushrooms, they look so tasty. Maybe this pot will prove useful after all. Cook. Oh. I don't have the mushrooms. Okay. So we need the mushrooms. Okay. Nail, rag, photo of a road, the road home. Okay, it is, there is like no door over there. I don't like that. Yesterday I barricaded one of the windows. If I want to stay here for some time, I should do the same with the other windows. Workbench, I cannot do anything with that. Stool. Large mushrooms harvest. Okay, so now I have the mushrooms. Let's see what else is in here. Mushroom book. The use of mushrooms in the household. Got a couple empty bottles. I've got alcohol. I've got some rope. Bear trap. I don't know if I should disarm that or not. No, no, cancel it. It did cancel it. Okay, yeah. Another lamp. It's a bed, but it won't even let me look at it. All right, let's see if we can cook the mushrooms now. Odd looking mushroom. I don't think that did enough. There's more outside. I can see more outside. Okay. Turn on the generator before dark. Okay. This guy's got a torch, some matches, and a rag. Okay. Feel like I gotta find some more mushrooms, right? Okay, apparently I need a key code for that. Convert wood logs to planks. No, I don't want to build a well. Okay, let's see what it says when I put this in, because... Okay, so we need three more mushrooms, basically. There's no way around it. All right. Burned house. There's some more. Uh, 
Uh-oh. Oh, shit. I stepped on mushrooms and poisoned myself, apparently. Damn it. Okay, relax. You can quit running. Can't fit any more big boards. That sucks. I have to fight something. No room in inventory for shiny stone. Drop the bottles. What's the shiny stone? Where is it? Okay, it didn't really say much about it. Wait, what? I swapped the gasoline can. Thank you. Okay. Oh, I thought I... What? I did pick up another mushroom, didn't I? I found a third one in that house. So where did it go? Uh, that's weird. I definitely found a third mushroom. What happened to it? Did it drop it? I need to repair the well so I can use it. Why won't that work? Oh, because it needs more fuel. Shit. Sure, repair the well. Why not? So I need more fuel for that, but at least that can stay dropped off. They have to be here somewhere. They have to be. There it is. That's so crazy. I had no idea it did that. Can I use any of this as a weapon? Rags, boards, flares. I can't use any of this as a weapon, damn it. That sucks. No, oh, no, 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 no. I also saw a bear trap. Let's go ahead and take that. Scrap metal. 
There's a fence. Is that my house? Yeah. I have no idea what the combo is for that. I have no fuel for that. Um, okay. Three. Damn it, I wish I could get more. Oh. Um, how do I barricade the windows? You have two. I need three. Oh, so I need more boards, but... Ah, oh, fuck, and I used all the fuel. Oh, shit. There's some fuel. It's probably not going to help much, but it'll help a little bit. Oh, God, it's getting dark, isn't it? I didn't even realize. Oh, no, it's not. Okay. There he is. Fuck, run. Run, run, run. Actually, give me that. Quick, quick, quick. Uh-oh. We're going to have to get back to the house soon. Looks like the sun's starting to go down. Sun's getting real low, big guy. Fuck. Man, I did not do enough to prepare for this night. If only I had more logs, man. I can't believe I chose the well over over that. I'm so screwed. I don't have any weapons. Like, I, I can't even... Can I make anything? I can make a board with nails. I guess I could do that. I mean, I need a weapon. And I have a couple traps. Um, and that's about it. All right. So, traps. I need to put those. Let's see. I have a torch. Scrap metal can go here. Where's my traps? Oh, that's what gave me the scrap metal. So I don't actually have traps. Okay. Well, I can make a bandage. And then use that. Okay. Use it. Okay, now, where, here we go, there we go, okay, I do have a second light, somebody's here, Can hear him. What the fuck? Poisonous mushrooms? Why are they growing? No, they're going to take out my light. Odd-looking glowing mushrooms. I don't even know where they went. There they are. I 
I could shut this door, like, if somebody comes in to the right, I could shut the door, like, go in here and shut the door, but... Um, but I was hoping the trap might get them first. I keep hearing somebody over here, to the right. I'm trying not to waste my torch, because it's running out. Either we're about to get attacked or daylight's about to hit. I think daylight's coming. Day two. Okay. Switch that off. Wolfman. Even from afar, I can smell your putrid stench. Be glad I don't have an appetite for carcasses meat. The figure hides its face under the hood. It smells of wet soil and fur. I know what you're after. I can help you reclaim what you've lost if you help me attend to a certain matter. What do you say, comrade? As he leans towards me, I can hear him giggling under the hood. I knew it would interest you. Before we make a deal, you need to prove that you can do the job. I have no time for weaklings, meat. You follow? Show me what you're made of. Get through to the silent forest. You think it's so easy? If I were you, I would prepare myself well before setting out. When you get there, you'll find me in this spot. Remember it. The wolf grabs my map and scribbles something on it. The likes of you always crawl back to me. What is show item? Plastic chick. Beautiful item, perfect for a church fair. What's that you got there? The wolf snatches the photograph from my hand and studies it carefully. Finally, he snorts, his thick yellow spit landing on the photo. Haha, <laughs> this road doesn't exist anymore. Overgrown with trees like all the other ones. The wolf throws the photo to the ground. Better forget about the road home, meat. Around here, all the roads lead to nowhere. Gossip. I'd avoid getting into trouble if I were you, meat, or at least until you get a decent weapon. If I were you, I wouldn't venture too far from here unless you get bored of your lousy life, meat. Only a few returned from the dense woods, and those who made it back were not able to share their happy stories. I wouldn't recommend wandering around these woods at night. It would mean certain death for you, meat. Better hide in that hideout of yours before dark and pray for the morning light. Trade. What's he got? He's got a toolbox. Batteries. Let's see. Shiny stone. Alright, so I've got 180, so I could buy something off of him. I feel like a metal pipe and tape would be useful, but I don't know. I honestly don't know. Um, so I'm just gonna just close for now. If you wish to spend some more quality time basking in the striking yet unnatural beauty of my features before you head off to the silent forest, you'll find me in my camp in the dry meadow. The wolf points to a location on my map. Okay, let's see. Shadows? Staying in dark areas at night can be dangerous to me. Okay, that's weird, but that was already a thing. Why did I have to... That was literally already a thing. I need to shut the generator off. Okay. So, I have fuel on me. Hold on. Can I put fuel in this thing? Let me see something. Number two. Refill. Okay, I can. This will give me some boards. Okay, now. There we go. Now we got some boards. Alright, and we can put that in there. 
All right, I gotta turn this generator off. I keep doing other stuff. I already wasted way too much fuel, so. Barricade. Okay. Barricade. Okay. Okay, that one's already barricaded. I need to build a door here, but I guess I can't. I don't know. And I have a weapon in case I get into trouble, like with this thing. Oh, how did I miss? Meat. Okay. I was going to see if I could do anything with those, but I guess you can't. There's another trap. This is the house. I'll find the entrance to the underground here. Actually, hold on. Entrance to the underground tunnels. I don't know if I'm tough enough, but... So I don't know if I should do that or not. Another dog over there, and a deer. Not gonna be able to kill that fucking thing. Uh, can't take the gasoline or the wire. Um, shit, I really need the gasoline. Uh, Me could be used as bait. I can drop that. What? Wire can't stack? Oh, I have rope, not wire. Um, what else do I got? Do I got anything else I can throw out? Rope, matchstick, alcohol, scraps, boards, bread, which is consumable. I could throw the stones. It says they're throwable. I don't know if that means that they're actually useful for anything. Uh, 
That gas is a little more full than the one I have. Um, okay. Filling this baby up. Okay. Then I'm going to use the rest over here. And then I'm going to go get that other jug. Where is it? There it is. All right, we got some more planks. I'm now able to make torches, bandages, and lock picks. Let's see. On the workbench, I can make an antidote and a chain trap, and then basically the same stuff. Upgrade workshop. All right, is it nighttime? I can't tell, because it's raining. Whoa. Uh, it's getting pretty dark over there with that guy, so I will just skip that. Uh-oh. Oh, Wolf's camp. Doesn't look like he's got anything useful, but... Um, oh, I thought I picked up another item to show him. Interesting. I guess not. But I got another shiny stone I can sell him, and I need this toolbox. So I'm going to buy that, I think. And... I don't know, I need something that looks like rags that isn't rags, but he doesn't have whatever that is. Gas, fuck. How much gas do I have? Uh, I need to put those two mushrooms away. I don't want to lose anything. Oh, wait. I can put the boards together and then that'll let me take the gas. Okay. What is that? There's more gas, but it's not as full as the one I have, so we'll leave it. All right, it's gonna get dark soon. All right, put that right there. All right, that thing is full. I gotta go start the generator. Okay, wait a minute, hold on. Okay, tank is empty. I wanted to get it out of my inventory. That's really what I was trying to do. Okay, I don't really have... What are my options with the door? Barricade or open? If I barricade it, I can't really get through it, can I? Alright, upgrade the workshop again. I can craft Molotovs now. 
I actually like have the ingredients. Still can't do the inventory upgrade. Really wish I could. All right. I'm going to wait out the night here, and uh, I think this will do it for the first Darkwood video. I hope you're enjoying it, though. If you are, tell that like button you want to smash, and don't forget to subscribe. You stay you. I'll stay me. Droogie forever. Thank you, everyone, so much for watching. I really appreciate it. I'll see you in the next video. Later.